My name is Eunice Mbogwa. My name is Diana Mutanda, and uh, I, I come from Nairobi County. I was born and raised in Nairobi County. My name is Michael Wahome Irungu. I hail from Kiabu County. I'll be traveling to Newark. Today, I'm moving to Grand Valley State University in Allendale, Michigan. I'll be pursuing my master's degree in data science at Montclair State University. Traveling to Missouri State University to pursue a gradu my graduate studies in project management. I am going to study a master's of science in health informatics and bioinformatics. To be very honest, I'm very intentional to making the best out of this chance. It's an opportunity and I thank God for it. So I'll make the best use for it, uh, out of it, and I'll, I'll maximum use or out, they, I'll utilize it to the, to the best way that I can because it's an opportunity. I don't know if I'll ever get it again, but I know if, because I have it now, I'll use it uh, the best way that I can. KEP has provided me with an opportunity to become a clinical data scientist, which I've always wanted to be. And this is a great opportunity because the resources that I will access at GVSU and also leveraging the resources at KEP and the community that they are building there of Kenyan students is an excellent opportunity to excel and build up my career growth. This opportunity is really going to help me progress and advance in my career because data science is really, really just an advancement of my undergraduate in economics and I believe after studying in a very good university like Montclair, it's a national university, I'll be able to really get great opportunities and advance in my career. You are watching Success with Bob Mweti Show, presented to you by Upstech America. Upstech America is a consulting company that helps immigrants find amazing higher education and job opportunities in the tech industry in the United States. You can find our programs by going to www.upstechamerica.com. Upstech America, we wake you up to the unlimited potential. KFP has been supportive throughout this whole program. I, I have had the opportunity to do GMAT training under Ken Moraguri. I also had an excellent time when selecting the schools. Ellie for answering all my questions. Bob and Wilfred during the visa process. I thank the whole KEP family for this opportunity that they have granted me and I will not take it for granted. So my experience with the program has been very good. It's really nice to have someone hold your hand when you need it, somebody to guide you, especially in such a lengthy process because this can be a very challenging journey. So maybe if you're watching this and you want to also start the journey, uh, find someone to hold your hand like our program here, Kenya Airlift. And uh, also keep your eye on the goal. You may fall, just remember to get up and remember the end goal. The Kenya Airlift program, I, I, I have no words to describe how much grateful I am to them because ever since I talked to Bob, the very first time I talked to Bob and I told him that I, I introduced myself and I told him what I want and he told me what to do and I'm so happy and they have guided me all through, all through, through those Zoom meetings every Friday, guiding us to, uh, through the school application processes, looking for loans, looking for cosigners, even if I didn't get a cosigner, then I was advised to go to another school. All that, they've been with me all through until I got my visa, even now they are still with me. And I know even when I get there, they'll still hold my hand, they'll not leave me. I, I feel, I'm confident enough that I won't get stranded when I get to the other side. It was the best feeling ever so far. I don't think I've ever felt that uh, feeling ever in my life for the part of my life that I've lived. Uh, it is the best feeling ever. Getting that blue sleep from that view was, it was just, I don't know how to explain it. And I remember walking out of uh, that, the embassy, going now out to the gate. I, I was just thanking God. I couldn't believe it took me days to, to take it in that I'm, I'm now relocating to the U.S. Yeah. My visa experience was 
a bit scary, but I was confident. I believed in myself, and uh, my visa was was approved. I got my visa 18 of this month, and I'm traveling today on 28. I'm traveling through Delta Airlines, connecting three flights from here to Paris, from Paris to Atlanta, from Atlanta to Springfield. It's quite a long flight, but. It's an adventure, so I'm excited. And then from there, I'll be picked up by the school, thanks to Kenya Airlift Program. And then I'll start life in Missouri. My flight is at 6 p.m., Ethiopian Airlines. We land in Addis Ababa. Then I'll take another flight from Addis Ababa to Dublin Island. Then from Dublin Island to Chicago, U.S. Then from Chicago to GRR in Michigan. So I leave from Nairobi at 9 a.m. headed to London. From London I'll go to Boston. From Boston I'll land at Newark where I'll be picked and uh, I'll go to New Jersey where I'll be staying. You have been watching Success with Bob Mwiti Show, brought to you by Upstech America. Come back again next time to learn concepts, tools, strategies, and resources on the path of becoming a successful immigrant in USA through real-life experiences. Be sure to subscribe to Bob Mwiti channel on YouTube and also follow him on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn.